hello friends welcome back to my channel kindly subscribe like the video share and comment so today we are going to see a simple fast tutorial on how to set up docker on ubuntu machine so we have been using mostly CentOS machine for setting up docker but i'm i'm sure there are a lot of people who want to use docker on ubuntu so there has been a lot of requests to how to set this up so it's a straightforward instruction how to do it so let's go to docker documentation page and uh, there is a clear documentation on how to set up docker ce for ubuntu okay so let's scroll down to the section where it talks about installation of docker engine okay, so and we are going to install community edition of, of docker so the first step is we need to run a sudo apt get update so we need to update the package uh, in ubuntu okay so let's go to the terminal okay so let's open the terminal and uh, copy the command from the docker documentation and run that okay and i have given all these commands in the video description so you don't have to go to docker documentation you can use the commands from my video description itself okay so since we are giving sudo you have to give the password for your root so let's wait for the update to be completed okay that's done okay let's go to the next command which is to add the repositories okay so let's copy this command and let's run that you can press yes Okay, so that is the also done okay the next command is to add the keys for docker okay so let's uh, use the curl command to add the keys so um, we are just copy the command and run it here okay so that is also done so we got the messages okay if you want to confirm whether the keys are correct so you can use this command uh, to get the fingerprints and the keys are correct okay so I run this command okay I think I have missed some parts so let's copy the whole com content okay. okay so now you can see we got the output Okay, so that's the key and it should be same as per the documentation okay let me clear out the console okay this is uh, the final step okay we need to add the repository again okay so we have added the repository as per our configuration of the machine okay if you have something else you need to do that and let's run the app get update again so this will be the last step so we just need to install the docker ce now so let's copy this command and run it and you can press y for you to continue So we need to wait for this installation to complete
okay so we, we are almost done okay so it's trying to do the same link of the docker services okay let's wait for it to be complete Okay, so the installation is completed. So let's uh, clear out the screen. So after the installation is completed, uh, the next step is uh, you need to try to run some Docker command. Okay. Okay, so before uh, running the docker command i think we need to start the docker okay so if you see it's uh, the status is running so in case if in your system if it's not running as a service you need to run the command system ctl start docker and then you need to enable it using system ctl enable docker so here it's by default it is enable uh, enable and started so i don't have to do that okay so you just try to run the command to create a docker container okay so if i run the docker ps there are no docker containers and there are no images so docker images there are no images running so i'm going to run the hello world uh, container so it's going to be docker run hello world okay and you can see the output is uh, you know hello from docker this message shows that your installation appears to be working right and you can see docker images we have a hello world docker image right with the docker ps you don't have anything showing up because the container is not running so you have to use docker ps hyphen a so you can check out my tutorials on the basic commands for docker so that will help you so i hope this tutorial is informative for you how to set up docker and ubuntu so you can set up your docker and you can start working on your process okay so thank you for watching i hope uh, We'll see you soon with another interesting tutorial. So kindly subscribe to my channel, like the video, share and comment.